My very first rope swing was awesome. It was about 20 years ago, and at the time we thought we were pushing limits. The bridge was maybe 75 feet, and everybody thought we were insane. You're not trying to speed it. <laughs> I was 12 years old when I watched that video, and I remember just feeling so excited and wanting to do it so bad. The scale of what we did then compared to what we're doing today has changed, but being with your friends and having a good time is still the same thing 20 years later. When we jumped off the bridge in Idaho, it was our first real attempt at something that big, and it gave us that initial excitement. We wanted to see how much free fall we could actually get. So we started thinking, why does it have to be a bridge? Why couldn't we swing off of something else, like a hot air balloon? You jump out of one hot air balloon while your rope is connected to the second hot air balloon. And as long as you're high enough, then you can go as big as you want. Hot air balloons are pretty hard to control, so once we get everything set up, we can only do two jumps, one from each balloon. The basic plan is to have the balloons at about 2,500 feet up and have the rope length just over a quarter of a mile. That should give us about eight seconds of pure free fall before the rope catches you. Oh, oh man! Hey. Woo! 